Hello everybody, as you think here, and today we are gonna do a fun little video. Basically, today we're gonna do a monster girl little tier list, right? I got this uh, little tier list here, and today we're just gonna be ranking them all. Alright? Purely design based. I told them the books, so uh I don't need monster girl encyclopedia books, so uh yeah. Let's do this. First off is Akane. Yeah, honestly, I'm gonna put it in B tier. Okay, it's, it's an okay monster, really. No, nothing that good. Uh, I could see the appeal with the tongue and everything, but not my thing. Now, this next one's gonna be being weird for half of you. Next one's Alice. Who I'm gonna put in the A tier. And most of you are probably thinking. Okay. Most of you are probably thinking. Bro. The. Clearly, you haven't read the books. I mean, don't you know Alice's description? Damn books! And yes, I know the whole, whole aroma that forces you to remember your sleep thing, but like, keep in mind, it's an aroma that does that shit. So, well, theoretically, no, I'm not that educated on what an aroma is, but I'm guessing it's like some sort of smell or something like that, right? So, theoretically, there's a way to block out that aroma. And once you figure it out, all you have is like some sort of cutesy little girl, right? And honestly, like, I don't give two shits, like, I am more of a cute person that likes cute things, right? Really. So, um, yeah. Alice is 18 because it's cute, and I imagine it, like, all I have to do is, like, buy a black doctor's mask and fill it to the brim with, like, nice smells, so, things that smell nice, so, yeah. So, uh, yeah. It works for me. I, I, I just really like how cute it is. Next one. Alright, Elf in, um, is in D tier, mainly because it's, like, the most masculine of it, and I consider the point of those books, like, I, I don't know, I just, something about it just makes me go, meh, you know what I mean? Like, no real reason. Okay, next one is Aloran, which, uh, I mean, come on, I'm really surprised I'm putting this baby in. Freaking S tier. I mean, it's no, it's like some sort of green plant lady in a giant flower. Yes. But how do you think? For like, I, I, I get, I, I get the point of those books. It's supposed to be like, like a book filled with like, oh, look at these monster girls. I probably want to get you, right? And with a couple exceptions. Go nuts. But like, I don't know why I just like the design. Like, I just imagine it just be, like, cute, and it also has, like, some sort of aroma. Also has some sort of, like, aroma scent, which I imagine would help with, uh, counteracting the Alice's whole rape aroma, so, uh, yeah. That would be certainly a plus. Yeah, Amazon is, like, in, uh, C tier, because, like, I don't know, there's really nothing that's special about it, like, like, it's some sort of, like, succubi and giant and lady, but, like, I don't know, there's really nothing that interesting about her, like, like, I like, guess yeah, she looks sexy, but, like, I'm the kind of person where, like, you need more than good looks to, like, get me interested, you know? I mean, hell, some of my rankings are gonna really upset you guys, so, like, yeah. I don't know, really, like, yeah, just, just see too. Yeah, the angel. Angel is A tier because look at it, it's it's so darn cute. Look at that. Look at that. That is just adorable and I love it. Some websites don't do that. When we're asking why I'm doing the like, mobile version, um I don't know how to record on my computer and and um well the audio broke. My my audio jack strap broke, so uh, yeah. So yeah. Anyways, next monster. Yeah, the Antarachnid, um... Yeah, not that attractive of a monster, to be honest. Like, it's okay. Nothing really that special. But I think it probably deserves to be a C tier, because, like... I don't know. It's alright. Anubis, um, putting that in B tier, because it's uh, slightly above these two. Now, the next one, uh, um... Opus or Opus F tier. 
honestly, it's just like a hot Lamia, and that's that's about it. Plus, it looks I don't know. It's something about the eyes. Just just no. Do not want to deal with that. Next monster. I have this next one, Absaris. Really weird reason, but believe it or not, the only reason I'm putting it higher, in, like the B tier, it's because like I really enjoyed using it. In, like Absaris and SMT. I know there's like a separate thing, but like. Yeah, I kind of like it. Um, okay, Arachnid. Uh, Arachnid is a solid C tier. So, uh, yeah, Arachnid is like a solid C tier. Um, really, nothing interesting. Really unremarkable. Uh, Archnip. C tier. Because. Meh. Alright, next one. Uh, Arachnid. Lakshanaga. Uh, um, really, really like this one. It's like a so like, Oh, it's a giant spiraling. How could you want to get that? I don't. I just really, I just think it looks cool. That's it. That's like the only reason I actually like this one. Because it looks, because in my opinion. Yeah, like, it just looks cool in my opinion. That's it. That's my only reason for liking it. The next one's like a automaton, and like there's like really nothing interesting about it other than it's a robot and it's kind of soulless. But like, eh. The next one's a bit of a controversial pick because uh, the banshee. That's indeed the I'm joking. It's it, baby. That's it, dude, baby. Yeah, the banshee is in the solid eight tier. Or like, like I don't know why, but like it's just like so. All majestic looking. You know, it looks just so quiet, and desolate. Like, it just looks so quiet, like it's like it could strike you at any moment. And yeah, it looks fine. Like, I don't know why. It's just something about its design that I really like. And that because, and that because of the big one. And not because of those big orbs. Shut up. It's just more so like the salty. Offamat. Solid F. Like, what? what is there to this thing? Like, it's okay, like... Also, what the hell? There's that weird, that weird green metal that's a commonly associated with Now this next one is called Barazum. 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 How the fuck you pronounce it? Uh, this one is like like a cute little jelly lolly, and I don't know why. It's kind of cute. Eat here. It's meh. All right, Basilisk is like in, in B. It's also in B tier for me because like. It's a basic lawn, yeah. There's nothing wrong with that. Like, I kinda like something more interesting out of my, uh, you know, there's like a lot of Lamia in the book. So I kinda like something a little bit more interesting in design wise, right? Like, you can feel me, right? Although I really, really like that, I think this gives it like an aura of mystery. Which, I can appreciate. This next one I do not need to give much of a reason. Or for you, you know. Bells above. But, what about this is fly like to you? Nothing. You're the Lord of the Flies and you look like a butterfly. What the hell? Yes, I am. <clears throat> oh, I should be accurate, damn it. Oh, yeah, also, Bicorn. Who in God's green earth wanted. Who in God's green earth wanted to, um. Yiff a horse? Just why? Black Harpy there because you no, know, just feels right. I was really here because like, uh, like those two had no. Like, 
one, but this next one. Ah, uh, yeah, baby, bubble slime. Ah, uh, no. Like, this bubble slime? I don't know, it's always been one of my personal favorite monster dolls in this book. Look, I, like, I've heard about it, and it was like one of the first ones I found out about it, and I've always thought, like, the bubble slime just looked like, really adorable, kind of. Like, you know how, like, in the anime, there's, like, that one character that always looks tired? Tired in this, like, really cute scene? Now, that's the, 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 the bubble slime has on me, like, it just constantly looks tired, like... Like, I remember this, like, game called Quest Failed? Yeah. There's a character, there's a mummy character in that game called Terry, who's always sleepy and is really cute because of it. But that's the effect Bubble Slime has on me. It just looks really adorable because it's so tired of the damn time. It's not like it. So, yeah, Alright, so the next one is also an A tier. It's the bunny. I don't know why, but this particular Vanya looks really cute. Next one, uh, Bunyip looks really adorable in my opinion. Like I love it. I, I like the Bunyip. Mm -hmm. It is, like looks really cute. Yeah, but it also kind of looks like it looks really shy and nervous constantly. And I always like things that look like this. It's so fluffy. Look at it. Look, look at the thing. It's so fluffy. All right, C tier uh, cat sit. Cat sit is um is an okay one. Nothing really special about her or other or than as like cat-like appearance. Also, and I don't know why, but like it's very easy to imagine this one like some sort of futa and like now. Uh uh, not, not gonna happen. No. So yeah, that's why I cast it. Alright, have the next one, cancer. Because I'm just kind of mad about it. I said it once, and I'll say it again. I actually want to bump this one up to like F tier. This is okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. I E tier because I like Pricksters. E tier is like, like, Pricksters so is like one of my favorite characters. And those kind of characters, like, you never know what they're gonna do. And, like, you know, 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 I like Chimera. Not sort of a local monster in the one. I feel like it doesn't show all that much. I feel like it doesn't really use that much potential in this design. It looks cool, but like, like it does more so like description wise. Alright, okay. So, uh. Sake Obaki. Sake Obaki. Chate, and Chate, Obake. It is like 82 because look at it. It's adorable. Yes. Up next is the pocket case. It's like a solid, like a solid scenario. It's really nothing that special. This, okay. That's all right. Yeah, bro. Uh, I can put in a D tier, and not because like of some the reason I'm excited to troll. Uh, here's the reason for this one is really stupid. Um, basically, one time I was reading a hentai comic about this, about like the freaking protein you and use this design, and then they're making a version that is really crazy. Like, like, uh, yeah, you can get where we go. It was just really bad, crazy. 
Same rank as the normal. So, this one like the same rank as the normal one because I like the idea of like corrupting. Yeah, that's what I think. Yeah, I like that. You know, dark elf. Ah, it should be turned up to be special. Ah, the dark mage from the thing. Although I do question the ability of the monster. Okay, this one I'm just gonna put enough because where are your clothes? Right? But seriously, where the fuck are your clothes? <laughs> the fuck are they? Look at the clothes on Jesus. Just don't beat this. To beat you. Don't know why. Uh, don't know why. So like, uh, yeah. So like. I don't know if I can hear like some like demon that's in the form of a priestess as I see the map on the mountain. That idea is always the same. I'm gonna play some of that trick for folks. Dark like slime? It's just a slime but more perverted. Interesting. Uh, Dark Valkyrie, I'm gonna put in like the same tier. Because I imagine it'd be like a damn good body card. Demon. Devil. It's here, so it gets one rank above, but like not much. Okay, double bug. Oh god, the double bug. Why? Why do you exist? I'll put you in F tier. Okay. Damn fire. It's like half human, half vampire. Uh, it's like a solid detail. I like the idea. Doppelganger? Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, as I was saying, I really love the idea of the doppelganger. Now, that one is like really cool because like, I place in this whole trickster motif by directly copying the form of a human woman. Like, that one's like interesting. I love that one. Dormouse. Let's be here. Because it feels it's just it's right. Alright, next one. Door. Door moon? I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna put that in C tier. Zombie Dragon. One rank above because I'm in. The Dragon. The Dragon is, um... You know what? No. No, it's like... The actor. I'm gonna put the in, uh... S tier. Alright, Dula. It's a solid A tier for me. Because, like, it's like, it's like a headless ghost or something like that. That's always cool in my opinion. And finally, uh, the dwarf. No. Alright, that's gonna do it for this video. Uh, until next time, I'm gonna have to see you again, uh, later. <laughs>